Aloha team, Gravit Fitness class. Uh, welcome, welcome, welcome. So we're just about to start now. We're gonna do a very nice dynamic warm up. You guys are in for a treat today. Uh, we're gonna start with a very nice warm up. Then we have six exercises, 40 seconds on, 20 off. Um, for four rounds yeah after this we have some stretches and um and then if you have any question after that uh please ask cool hello welcome welcome let's do this okay so let's warm up we start with the warm up mm. Okay, I just mute everybody. Good. Nice. Good morning, Bruno. Nice. Let's do this. So first one, you're just going to point your left foot up and roll that right, roll, left, right. Nice, and we go backward from here. So step. My back pointing. Nice. And drive. Nice. Nice one. Then we're gonna go with feet sideways. Feet sideways. Nice. Feet sideways. Good. Very good. Good work. Oh, very nice. From here, now we're going to go hurdle skips. And backward. I try to find the floor behind you, yeah? Work on your balance. Today we have some, lots of capoeira movement, lots of capoeira moves. So we gotta make sure that our balance is good. So now next one, you're gonna go for Russian walk. So what I want you to do, I want to keep your legs straight. You're gonna kick up and then flex your feet, lean forward, yeah? Work on your landing. Again, kick up for your hamstrings, a very nice stretch. Point. How tight you are, good, and we turn, face the other way, we're going to bring one leg back as if you're going to kick a ball, bring one leg back, kick up, land, 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 excellent, yeah, nice, very nice, just make sure that when you're kicking up, you are feeling, you are feeling the back of your leg, a very nice stretch. Cool. Nice. Next one, I'm going to go for a big lunge. Just mind your landing. So lunge, stay upright. You're going to bring the chest close to your knee. Opposite arm, opposite leg, and step. Front leg, and step. Good. Nice. From here, we're going to go backward. Yeah, to go backward. To go backward, we keep the weight to your front leg, lean forward a little bit, keep your back nice and straight, push from your front leg, push back. Front leg, push back, nice. Front leg, push back, awesome. Next one, we're gonna go for the horse walk. We have one more participant joining. Opa. Okay, go. Cool. Nice. So we have the horse walk, we have the feet pointing out, getting low, yeah? I'm gonna step out, shift the weight, step, shift, step, shift, step, nice. So every time when you shift, you wanna try to have one leg going towards being straight, so you can get a very nice stretch through your groin. Yeah, sitting back, step, shift the weight, yeah, step, shift. 
Nice. And we go backward. Excellent. Good. And from here, we're going to go for the frog. So we're going to get low. Point your feet out. Yellow. Hands on the ground. We're going to walk forward. Yeah. Step forward. Right leg. Feet as close as you can to your hand. Left. Make it nice and straight. Drive. Arms overhead. Hands down. Step back one. Step back two. Walk backward. And stand up. Nice and thin. Squat down. Both hands forward. Step one. Step two. Arms overhead. Two more. Yeah, walk back. Step one, step two. Great. Nice work. Very nice. Next one, we're gonna do a tabletop before going on the crab walk. So you have both the hands on the ground, one hand in the other. Nice. We're gonna push the hips up. Make sure the blades back together. Nice. We're gonna step right, left. Nice. Yep. Yeah. Walk forward. And we're going to go backward. Push the hips up if you can. Nice. Good work. Very good. And tiger crawling. I'm going to have both knees close to the ground. Try to keep your knees close to the ground the whole time as we're doing that. And you're going to drive one knee, right knee left and the hands move as well one knee one hand one knee one hand and we go backward knee hand knee hand knee hand awesome yes nice how are you guys feeling good warmed up yeah cool okay so 40 seconds on 20 off today uh, six exercises 24 minutes of effort yeah so first exercise today we have a new one for you guys called jinga second one we have holy you as well then we have some side hip lifts i'm going to demonstrate each one of those yeah for one side maybe we start with the right side today side hip lift then left on the side hip lift then we have a half a Hindu and we have CO jacks. So demonstrate each one of those. Yeah. The first one we're going to demonstrate, I'm going to demonstrate is called Jinga. So Jinga is a basic capoeira movement. Yeah. We're going to go one foot parallel to the other. Yeah. And I'm going to step back first with my right leg. Step back. And then like a lunge. Yeah. So I have the hand at the front. Yeah. Yeah. Sandra done this one before, yeah, good. So you see, I'm not all the way down here, just a little bit, yeah, like maybe half lunge. And then I'm gonna step on the side. Shift my weight. Good, step and shift. So you see on the back foot, one thing that I want you guys to, to um, feel in this one is that when I step, sideways over here i have weight on my front leg so my front foot i have weight in there and i have on my back so see i'm leaning back yeah and then with with the leaning back then after i'm gonna lean forward step on the side step back or oh, lean back so i'm not i'm not extending my back i'm not doing that with my back my back stays straight yeah so if you go so if i go sideways over here my back is straight just my feet my heel towards the ground forward step on the side step back and i'm changing my arm yeah yeah good go awesome so if it's your first time doing this one what I want you to do during these 40 seconds, take it very easy, okay? Take it easy, use it as your recovery, okay? Don't go too fast. If you've done this one quite a few times, 
you can speed up the, the pace. Remember the opposite arm keeps moving as well, okay? So you have Jinga. The second one is Rolet. So Rolet, we're gonna go on the ground, yeah? So on the ground, then we're gonna move laterally. So both your hands on the ground, yeah? And I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go to the left first. So I'm gonna go arm over my head, and then my feet gonna do like a semicircle on the ground. Yeah, my feet never gonna fly, not gonna uh, stepping over the other leg. I'm gonna go hand, and then I go touching the ground, touch the ground, touch the ground, and then I do the same thing the other side. Yeah, feet keeps touching the ground, doing like a semicircle. Yeah, again, left, and then I go semicircle on the ground, other side. Yeah. Other Let me have a look at you guys doing it. Let's do this. Yeah. Good. Both your hands. Nice. Semicircle, semicircle, semicircle. Good. Very good. Let's try not to fly the feet. Good. That's it. Let's go, Sandra. <laughs> cool. Judith, the camera is a bit too high for me to have a look. Yeah. Yeah. Good. That's it. Nice. So semicircle with the feet. Let's do that. Nice. Okay. Great. Okay. Nice. So we did Jinga, Rolet. Now side the hip lift. With the side the hip lift, we're really gonna be getting the oblique. So I'll give you two options, yeah? So you start on the right side today. Gonna have the elbow on the ground, same line as my shoulder, yeah? So option number one, if that's very hard for you to do that, I want you to have the right knee still on the ground, yeah? Just gonna hold sideways yourself like this, okay? Option number one, that's easier. Now option number two is harder. We have one foot separate from the other, yeah? And I'm lifting up my hip, come back down, lifting up, okay? If that's too hard, remember, you keep one knee on the ground and stretch the opposite leg. Yeah, cool? Nice. So when we've done that one side, if you can't do for 40 seconds, that's fine. Just do as many seconds as you can, yeah? Then we're gonna do the same thing the other side. So we're gonna go left arm, option number one, knees bent, yeah? And I'm lifting up my knee, my hip. If that's okay or too easy, both feet or leg in front of the other, okay? And lifting up. Nice. Now next one is a great exercise for your, for your upper body. It's called half a Hindu, yeah? So you're gonna go like this. I'll give you two options as well. Option number one is Cobra. It's a bit easier version. It's a yoga movement. So you're gonna go chair. Nice. So chest on the ground, hands over here. Option number one, cobra. Just gonna look up. Yeah, come back down. Feet pointing back, legs straight. Yeah, go. That's option number one, yeah. Option number two, we're gonna go on the tip of the toes, go to a plank, bend the knees, yeah, bend my knees. And then dive in, dive in, look up. Pull belly button in, arch my back. Arch, 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 arch. Lean back, bend my knees, dive. Look up. Yeah. So it's almost like if you're going like a U shape and then you're gonna pull belly button in, curve your back, knees gonna be bent, dive in, okay? That's it, yes. Go. Half a Hindu, or you can choose Cobra, yeah? And then the last one, we're gonna do a little bit of plyometric. So you're gonna do a little bit of jump. With this one, if you have any pain on your knees, or ankles, or lower back, you don't need to jump, you just do a lateral step. So I give you option number one. Easier version. Just gonna step on the side, close your hands together. Yeah, step on the side, that's easier version, yeah? Open up the arms, step together, yeah. Go, option number two, just gonna open up the arms, hop. 
every time you're opening up both arms, you want to try to bring your shoulder blades back together, really open up there. So if you've been in the computer all day, that's a great exercise to open up through your chest. Yeah? Pectoral is major, minor. Yeah. Really open up there, shoulder blades back together. Heart rate go up. And then we go back to Jinga. Okay? So Jinga, Holy, side hip lift, side hip lift, half a Hindu, and CO jacks. Cool. Let's do it. Let's smash it. Yeah? So you're going to put over here, little track, and we go for it. You. Okay. Okay. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. Let's do a jinga. Crank it. Find your balance. Nice. Side step, back, forward, back, forward, side step back yeah nice very good looking good team that's it nice back and forward step back forward yeah nice and five three two one and time nice you can remember now we're gonna go to the floor hold it ten seconds to go Three, two, one, let's go. Thumbs over, same circle. I'm over. Thumbs over. Nice. Thumbs over, same circle. Ten seconds to go. Awesome. Cool, very nice. Nice one. Now let's get this abs on fire. Yeah. So you go for the right side first. Elbow on your side. Let's do it. Five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Ten seconds to go. Three, two, one, and time. Nice, definitely warmed up. <laughs> nice, five seconds, we go to the other side. Four, three, two, one, let's do it. Nice. That's a one, that's a one. Push the hip up. Hang in there. 10 seconds to go. Three, two, one, and time. Whew. 
Very nice. Make sure that you have some water close by. Keep yourself well hydrated through it. Nice. Half a handle now, or cobra. You choose. Let's go. Three, two, one. It's on. And five. Nice, now we go for the seal jacks. Remember we have two options. One you jump in, the other one you just do a lateral step. Yeah? Nice, on five, four, three, two, one. Let's do it. Nice work, team. Nice work. And time. Oh, very good. We go back to Jinga. Nice, another 10 seconds. Yeah. You. <laughs> Sandra is on fire over there. Nice, let's go. It's on. Step on the side, back, forward, step on the side, back, forward. Nice. Another thing that I want you guys to try to remember is to keep your feet close to the ground as much as you can. If you jump up, you are easier to fall, easier to be taken down. You want your feet to be just hovering the floor when you do the lateral step, close to the floor. Nice. Nice. And time. Good work. How we go for the whole day. Nice one. How are you guys feeling? How are you guys feeling? Yeah, cool, cool. Awesome. Three, two, one, let's go. Hold it. Both your hands on the ground. Semicircle with your leg. Um semicircle. Nice. I'm over. Same circle. Other side. I'm over. I'm over. Five seconds to go. And time. Good work. Good work. Nice. Okay, now that you guys done that on the first round, yeah, we are on our second round. Side the hip lift. Let's see if we can get two extra reps this time, yeah? Three, two, one, right side first. Let's do it. Five, three, two, one, and time. Whoosh.
Very nice. Another 10 seconds. And go for the other side. Five seconds to go. Let's do it. Three, two, one, and time. Well done, team. Well done. Can you do it? I'm going to go now for the half a Hindu or Cobra. Four, three, two, one. Let's do it. So we start from the ground. Bend your knees, stretch your arms. I think if you're doing the half a Hindu, look up, pull belly button in, stretch your arms, dive in. Five seconds to go. And start. Nice, very nice. We'll go for the CO jacks. Nice. Let's start. We're coming to the end of our second round. Three, two, one, let's do it. Four, three, two, one, and time. Nice, very nice. Now that you guys done two rounds already with Jenga, now this one, try to give me two extra repetitions. Yeah, you're gonna get low there. For five, four, three, two, one. Move, step sideways, back, forwards. Lateral step, shift your weight. Nice walk, team. Nice walk. Get lower, get lower. Ten seconds to go. Hang in there. Looking good. Four, three, two, one, and time. Nice. Awesome. You guys are pro capoeira now, eh? Capoeira pros. Capoeira bros, capoeira pros. So uh, we go now for the holly. Four, three, two, one, let's do this. Both your hands on the ground, arms over your head. Nice. Remember that the foot doesn't fly. Both feet keep it touching the ground the whole time. Nice. Shoulder blades back together. Feel very familiar with the floor. Arms over. Stretch one leg, tuck in. Same thing the other side. Stretch one leg, tuck in. Nice. Four, three, two. One and time.
Are you guys with me or what? <laughs> half, half is still asleep. What's going on? Let's go. So side hip lift for three, two, one. Let's do it. Third round, team. Third round. Just a reminder that at any time you feel discomfort, feeling like dizziness, please just stop. Take your time. Yeah. And then continue when you can. Ten seconds to go. And time. Going to go the same thing on the other side. Let's go. Left. Pushing up, hips up. You can have the hand on the top or hand on the hips. Pushing the hip right up. Feel your obliques. Hang in there, 10 seconds to go. Push the hip up, feel the obliques, five. And time. Woo. Nice, very good team, do you well. Good stuff going now for the half a Hindu or Cobra. Four, three, two, one, let's do it. Sit together, push up if you're doing the cobra. Come back down, big inhale. Nice and striking and um, Half a Hindu, dive in, looking at pull belly button, arch your back, bend your knees, dive in. Three, two, one, and time. Nice. Good stuff. We're going off for the seal jacks. End of the third round. You guys doing well. We only have one more round to go. Three, two, one. Show me what you got. Let's go. Ten seconds to go. Three, two, one, time. Good work, good work. Last round now. Jinga. <laughs> Let's go. Three, two. One, let's go. Close to the ground. Back and forward. Back, forward, lateral step. Nice one, team. Very good. Looking good. Nice walk. Very good. Keep those arms up. Five seconds to go. Three, two, one, and time. You. Well done, well done. Looking good. You go for the holy.
Both your hands on the ground. Five, four, three, two, one, let's go. I'm over. Other side. I'm over. Nice one, last round. Let's do this team. Five, four, three, two, one, let it go. Good work, good work. Nice. Side hip lift, right side, side hip lift to the left. Half a Hindu seal jacks. Only four more exercises, that's us. Let's do this. Side hip lift. Three, two, one, let's do it. Let it burn, let it burn. Five seconds to go, hang in there. Three, two, one, and time. Oh. Definitely feel the abs now. Since the first round, I'm feeling the abs. <laughs> Get your blicks on fire. Do the same thing the other side. Left elbow on the ground. Three, two, one, let's do this. Pushing the hip up, control down, push. Pushing the hip up. Hang it there, team, hang it there. Nice work. Judy, nice work, Sandra. Nice work, George. Swan, Blair, four seconds to go. Come on, hang it there. Three, two, one, and time. Wow. Nice, you're going off for the half a Hindu or Cobra. Good. I'm gonna see if we can push two extra reps in this one, yeah? Two extra reps, so four, three, Two, one, let's do this, let's do this. Diving. Three, two, one, and time. Nice, very nice. If you have no pain on your knees, lower back, or ankle, go hard. Okay, I wanna see it all out now. It's your last effort. Let's go, four, three, two, one. Show me what you got, let's go. Open up those arms. Halfway there. Five, two, one, and time. It's over. Well done, well done team. Nice, very nice. We go now straight into some stretching. Yeah, 
Nice one. Let you guys recover a little bit. Well done, well done. Nice. Class of today. You guys matched it. A little bit of new skills. A few capoeira movement. So let's get into it. Yeah? So stretch. So you're going to take a seat. Yeah. Leg straight. You're going to bend your right leg in front of you. And left one. Right on the side. Put your hand on the right knee. Left knee. Stay as upright as you can. See if your feet can be sideways like this. Yeah. Feet sideways. Foot sideways at the back. Almost like if you're going 90 degrees. If your front leg 90 degree on the side. As upright as you can. Nice. Very nice. From here now, you're going to put right hand at the back, left hand at the back. Just shift a little bit so you can see better. Yeah. And then we're going to pivot our feet. Feet. Good. Opening up through your hips. Upright. Nice. Same thing the other side. Nice. And go one more time. Yeah. Upright. Hip opener. And go back there. Go. And come back. Great. Nice. Now we're going to stretch both legs. Right leg, left. Have a little shake there. Go like this so you can see better. Right leg now going to go over the left. Tuck in, close yourself as upright as you can. So both your hands close to your knee. Now from here, I'm gonna hug with my left arm, stay upright, and I'm gonna start turning towards my right side. Right hand go on the ground, start turning. Keep the chest up, close to my knee. Keep breathing. Nice, we come back, same thing the other side. Right leg now over the left. Right hand, as upright as you can. Left arm, left hand on the ground. Look over your left shoulder slowly. Nice one, and let it go. Well done, shake both legs. Now you're going to go left leg, right leg, open wide, both your hands behind your back, try to be as upright as you can, yeah, and try to sit in the pubic bone, hip bone, sorry, yeah, as upright as you can, good, very nice, from here now, going to lean forward yeah so both your hands in front of you if you can if that's already plenty for you by staying like this just stay there yeah if that's not enough both your hands feel a very nice stretch through your groin or <laughs> or behind your legs yeah hamstrings get a very big stretch good from there see if you can lean forward Keep breathing. Nice. And let it go. Well done, well done. Nice. Now from here, we're going to stretch the left arm. Yeah, you're ready in the position. Just going to stretch up right. Left arm, sorry. Right elbow now going to be towards your thighs. If you can, you're going to look towards your left hand and going to start bending yourself sideways from there. Imagine stay in the same position, just your arm is moving. You shouldn't feel your lats. Yeah? So, latissimus dorsi, biggest muscle we have on our upper body. Your back muscles. If you're tight through your through your abs, you might even feel that too. Right arm, left, looking towards your hand, 
Nice, just your arm is going, you stay. Nice, keep reaching. Big stretch for the lats. Very good, if you've been sitting on a computer, not raising up your arms very much, it's a great stretch. Nice, and let it go. All done, good. You bring both knees together. You're going to a hero pose, so both knees, hands by your, hands by your knees. Nice. If you can, have your feet pointing back, yeah? Like this, feet pointing back, yeah? Both the hands in front of you. We go, tip of your fingers, slowly, 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 bringing your whole palm of your hand on the floor. Good. If you can, you're gonna lean backwards now. Forearm stretch. Say that. Good work. And we're gonna pivot. So we're gonna have right hand, back of the right hand against the ground. Kiss you a bit better. So go like this. Left hand. Nice. If you can stretch arms. If that's too much, have one hand flat on the ground with the back of the hand and the same thing the other side. Yeah. And let it go. Well done, well done. From here, we're gonna go for extended chair pose. So we're gonna stretch both arms forward. Nice. Good work, very good, very good. And just to finish it off, we're gonna go plank. We're gonna step forward with your right leg. Yeah, left knee now touch the ground. Stay upright. Yeah, now the right knee gonna start going forward. You're gonna get a very nice stretch through your hip flexors. Yeah, upright. You can have both your hands on the hip first. Both arms now above your head. See if you can reach up there. If you can, you're gonna lean forward a little bit deeper. Remember, you're not leaning backward, just stay upright. See for our torso. No back extension. Nice, come back. Arms down, so change your legs. Left. Lean forward, as upright as you can. Good. From there, arms up. If you've been sitting too long or cycling too long as well, hip flexors should be very tight. So that's a great stretch for that. Nice. And arms up. Good. From here, now we're going to stand up. So you're going to go left, right, both arms above your head. Hands to your heart, back nice and straight. Thank you. Nice. 